very good friend shanna is here with me today and we are going to be doing a let's play for you of oregon trail <laughs> and we're going to be playing um, oregon trail 2 apparently um so it's really high def um it's yeah super hd um so we're super excited it's got great graphics yeah it's got really good graphics <laughs> really good um, all right, so the Oregon Trail. You may one travel the trail, two learn about the trail, three see the Oregon top ten, or turn the sound off. What is your choice? Huh. I'm going into this blind. We're gonna go ahead and go on the trail. Okay, many kinds of people made the trip to Oregon. You may one be a banker from Boston. Two, be a carpenter from Ohio. Three, be a farmer from Illinois. Or four, find out the difference between these choices. I don't think we should find out the difference. I think no. we'll just pick one. Yeah. I think the carpenter from Ohio would okay. be good because if our if our like if our wagon breaks, our wagon breaks down, we can fix it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's right. bound to happen. Oh, look at our cute little family. What is the first name of the wagon leader? It should be Mr. Yan. Mr. Yan. Mr. Yan. Okay. What are the first names of the four other members in your party? Well, obviously Shanna. Oh. And Kristen. And who else is in our wagon train? Should we put Jamie in there? Okay, we'll put Jamie in here. <laughs> Jamie, you're in our wagon train. Um, and then I guess we should put Jamie too. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So if we make it to Oregon, we can't reproduce. Well, yeah. I, I mean... We can only reproduce with Mr. Yan. <laughs> only with Mr. Yan? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> are these names correct? Our children are going to pop out with top hats and capes on. <laughs> so sick. <cool. laughs> Going back to 1848. It is 1848. Your jumping off place for Oregon is Independence, Missouri! Oh, yeah! That's like 15 minutes away! Okay, you must decide which month to leave Independence. March, April, May, June, July, or ask for advice. Well, it is Independence, so maybe we should leave on like, in like July. You think so? It's gonna be like, but, yeah, but by July, like, if we leave then, we've only got a month and a half oh, no. okay. to get there. Oh, oh. Well, I'm March. going to April. Okay, April. <laughs> no, because March might be cold. Yeah. It's pretty crappy in March. Okay, before leaving Independence, you should buy equipment and supplies. You have $800 in cash, but you don't have to spend it all now. Okay. You can buy whatever you need at Matt's general store. Who's Matt? I don't know if I trust This guy. This oh, is there's Matt. Matt. Hello, I'm Matt. So you're going to Oregon. I can fix you up with what you need. A team of oxen to pull your wagon. Clothing for both summer and winter. Plenty of food for the trip. Ammunition for your rifles. Spare parts for your wagon. Okay, great, Matt. Thanks. Okay, Matt's general store. Independence, Missouri. Oxen. Okay. There are two oxen in a yoke. I recommend at least three yoke. I charge $40 a yoke. How many do you want? Well, he says we have to get at least three, so let's just leave three. Get three. They're probably really expensive. Yeah, they are. I recommend you take at least 200 pounds of food for each person in your family. I see that you have five people in all. You'll need flour, sugar, bacon, and coffee. My price is 20 cents a pound. Oh my god, math. Um, uh, 200 pounds for each person. For each person? So there's there's five people in our, in our group, right? Yeah. So we're gonna want... We want... Okay. So it'll be 100, right? 100 pounds of food? Oh my god. That's a lot. But 200 pounds per person. 200 pounds per person? That's what he says. That's what he said. 100 pounds. Okay, then it'll be 200. 10,000, right? 10,000. Oh, man. Okay, well, let's just, let's do... Well, let's do, like, 800. Oh my god. Not 8,000. <laughs> I'm really hungry, Shanna. <laughs> I'm really, really hungry. <laughs> 
of the sushi. I'm really hungry, all right? Besides, we, we can't let Mr. Yan starve, so... Mm-mm. But also, he probably wants a flex to rest or something. That was only $160, so that's not bad. Oh, man, <laughs> that's... <laughs> Mr. Yan needs cigarettes. Okay, clothing! Yes, the only part I'm good at shopping for. <laughs> You'll need warm clothing in the mountains. I recommend taking at least two sets of clothing per person. Each set is ten dollars. So two yeah. times five, I can do this. So that's ten. So we I need at least ten. But I think we should get fifteen because, like, obviously we need to set up a clothing store when we get this. <laughs> okay, so we've spent like half our money. Sweet time for ammunition. Woo! All right, I sell ammunition in boxes of twenty bullets. Each box costs two dollars. How many boxes do you want? Like, 30. Is that good? I think so. That's like, what, $60? Yeah, math. Oh man. Okay, spare parts. parts. We're gonna need some spare parts. Well, we're a carpenter, we should just be able to make our own spare parts. We could. But I doubt this game is like that advanced. Probably not. Let's get two wheels. Two wheels. And an axle? Or you want more than one axle? So two of them. Two axles. And wagon tongues. What's a wagon tongue? It's like the part that connects the oxen to the oh, wagon. Oh, okay. Um, I don't I know why I know that. I just do. I feel like those would break easily. Can I get three? Go for three. Oh my god, five hundred sixty dollars! I'm not gonna have enough for until pretty now. When we get to San Francisco. <laughs> okay, press spacebar to leave the store. I'm getting the hell out of here. Woo. Well then, you're ready to start. Good luck! Yay. Thanks, Matt. I'm gonna need it. You have a long and difficult journey ahead of you. I hope I don't die. Now loading the wagon. Stop in the wagon.